cannot be suitable to have a church for this age that we are living in unless we are willing not to go on but to go back go back to this Bible and walk into tracks that were laid for us to walk in as Christians. Amen. We can't condemn folks because they're not Christians. We can't look at these young men out here and get our arm because they they won't do this or they won't do that or they beat their wives or they do, do all the stuff you're talking about. This is the stuff that you and I are to straighten out with the help of the Bible. You can't follow me from here to Houston and expect to get to Houston. You've never been there. And I'll tell you, while we're leaving in the morning at 9 o'clock, you follow me. But instead of leaving at 9, I'm going to leave at 6. How are you going to get there? You can't follow me. I don't need no smoke screen or nothing. You, if you're going to follow me, you've got to follow me. And you'll be comfortable knowing that I know where I'm going. And that's the same, same way it is. It can't be no plainer than that. If we're going to walk into the kingdom of God, we're going to have to follow the man that laid the tracks for us to get there. Amen. And his name is Jesus. No way of, ain't no Manchester or, <coughs> or Harris or no this or that. We either follow Christ or we're going to miss the mark. Okay, it, 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 that's it. And if we make up in our mind that we're going to follow him and we're going to teach children, we're going to help children, we're going to do what we can, it ain't going to make us pop up. We are not supposed to be pop. Jesus said, if they do this in a green tree, you know what they're going to do to a driver. And he was saying, you know what they're going to do to you if they do this to me. We're not going to be pop. We're not going to be the most famous person in town. But that don't stop us from doing and fulfilling our calling to Christ. I couldn't hoop and holler out there in that park. And I can't stand here and hoop and holler at you. Because I don't believe that that's preaching, and I don't believe that that's the way God. I believe God wants us to paint the picture so plain that a blind man can't miss it.